What's up guys, welcome back to another FIFA 21 video and today I'm going to show you guys or tell you guys actually what I think the best options for from the Icon Swatch promo is. Now we've got a few new packs, now you've got the 83 plus one which is essentially a pack containing 25 uh, cards which are at least 83 rated. Again, much like the 85 one, yeah this one's 5 85 plus cards. We've got an ultimate pack option which in my opinion is a really good one, essentially two tokens for two ultimate packs. Ultimate packs or 125k packs, therefore valuing each token at you know essentially 125k or a 125k pack. Well, I'll point out as well, they are untradeable. These packs also got Vidic there, which, in my opinion, straight away, unless any pros watching this have used Vidic, he's unreal. In terms of just looking at his stats, I think Vidic is definitely a no go, uh, unless maybe you're a United fan. Uh, but uh, I just don't see him being meta for too long again when they bring more promo cards out, you know. Uh, especially with how many promos he do these days, you know, he's just going to be left behind and his value will drop massively and just get outplayed by new promo cards. We've got the base icon pack for eight, which when you can get, you know, two, you can get essentially eight ultimate packs or one base icon pack. In my opinion, you know, you've got to go for the ultimate pack one. I'm not too sure these are repeatable, but if they are repeatable, like the ultimate packs, eight ultimate packs for me is better than a base icon pack. That's what I go for personally. Uh, like essentially it's like 1 million coins worth of packs or a base icon pack where you probably get like a four 500k icon. Hadji's there as well for 9 again I wouldn't go for that it's not a great one. Base or mid icon pack now so essentially from what I understand from this is you put an extra two tokens in and you have the chance of getting mid icons as well which I mean if they wasn't the ultimate pack option I would say that's probably decent however again 10 tokens or 10 ultimate packs the real question is, if anyone can confirm this, is the ultimate pack one repeatable? If it's not repeatable, then that argument kind of goes out of the bin. Uh, but for me, you definitely got to do the ultimate pack one for two. That is probably the best one out there. Uh, the 83 plus 25 pack, again, is something you've got to be doing. Uh, especially if you're doing lots of SBCs, that is a must do. Because every single card in there will be useful for SBCs. You've also got the chance of packing walkouts. Uh, and honestly, I think 25 cards in one pack, all guaranteed to be board drops. That's literally 25 guaranteed board drops. That is going to be one of the most limbs packs ever. Again, the 85 plus one's going to be decent. You only get five cards in it though. But equally, those two packs of release are going to be absolute limbs getting watched open uh, by you know streamers, etc. But the ultimate packs, like I said, is what you've got to do. I see the 83 plus one's also a must do. Even the 85 plus one's probably worth the gamble. Uh, if I would pick between, obviously, the 83 plus one and the 85 plus one, I would say the 83 plus one's more worth it in terms of what you're getting for your tokens. Uh, Moving on, when the uh, the menu stopped lagging and my, my catch card stops lagging, uh, we've got Suka or how he says his name for, again, I, just, I wouldn't go for him, he does not too great. Again, so here we've got some more options, the mid or prime icon pack, uh, we've got the mid icon pack, we've got Komi, we've got Viacard, again, for me, I don't know, the mid icon pack, that is how many tokens, I can't even see how many tokens it is, it's not even loading. Uh, well, if we go off, it's, yeah, that's a problem, man, the EA servers are awful right now. Uh, also got Komen there for 13, for me Komen, I don't see many people using Komen, I don't think he's too great as a centre half maybe. Uh, I find kind of mad how Komen has 88 shooting, his shooting is nearly equal to his defending, I mean, in terms of like a, that card, it'd be unreal as a centre mid surely, like, you know, a centre mid slash a CDM, or even slash a cam, you know, that card, anywhere in midfield would be ideal. Uh, if that was like a centre mid card, then that would be, I imagine, worth so much more. Uh, the middle prime icon pack for 15. Again, you know, the mid icon pack is 12. Put an extra three tokens in for the prime one. Uh, I don't know. I think, I, I say you could do an icon pack. I'd say go for the, the middle prime icon pack one. Uh, but again, in terms of the individual icon options, they all don't seem worth it, in my opinion. You know, Obviously, Coleman for 13, I think it was, isn't worth it, in my opinion. Vicard, 15, again, definitely not worth it. You know, you have, have a guaranteed Vicard, 90 rated, or a mid or prime icon pack. I'd probably risk it, to be honest with you. Uh, also, it's for the content, boys, so, you know, you've got, you've got to take the gamble. Now, this one, 89 plus mid icon pack. So, a bit more safety on that one. That's 16. Uh, now, that actually might be a quite sensible option. This one's a base icon player pick. I, I've got to say... I think EA have smashed it with icon swaps. Uh, 
they gave us way more variation. There's two, there's new packs as well. There's tons of new packs. There's more variation. Uh, the only thing I'd say is the guaranteed icon ones like the armory, the comb, and the buy card. I think are slightly over. Probably like not worth it as much. I like they put it as too many tokens. Armory for 17. Uh, not a bad option, but I don't know. It's, it's a left winger. Is that going to be you know a viable card you know, three four months down the line? Probably not. Like 90 pace, 88 shooting, 87 dribbling, it looks good. Obviously base stats on the front, but I just, I think, I just wouldn't go for the individual individual icons. In my opinion, you've got to go for the ultimate pack one, you've got to go for the 80, 83 plus for the pack, and then whatever tokens you've got left, either go for like a, a base icon pack, a mid icon pack, and get, have a gamble on there. But in my opinion, you stay away, far away from just like the single icon SBC, like the Omri, the Komen ones, because they just simply aren't worth it.